what is up YouTube first of all I want to say happy Halloween to all you guys and if you could please leave a like uh, on this video that would be greatly appreciated second of all I want to thank you guys for all the support and feedback on my speed art that was really cool of you guys and as promised I'm gonna bring you this tutorial on how to make that static effect so I want to show you how that static effect would look in action so this is a background I've been making for Aztec Central and it has a static effect I had more stuff to it you know um, but yeah, so first off, what you want to do is you want to go in the description and download the pattern. It's going to be called Chemicals Effects, something like that. And you're going to need to download that. And um, to install that into your Photoshop, actually, you want to go to Computer, uh, OS, Disk, C Drive, I guess, Program Files, Adobe. You want to go to Adobe Photoshop. Then you're going to want to go to presets. Once you're in presets, you want to go to patterns. And once you're in patterns, you just drag in the chemical effects patterns into here. And then make sure Photoshop is closed. And then when you open it, well, first we're going to make a, a background so it doesn't look all nasty. Uh, sure, I'll make that. All right, we're gonna make it like that, and then we're gonna add. Uh, we're gonna make a new layer, like I did. If you click on this; is right next to the trash can tool. You're gonna want to go to Edit, Fill, and then Contents. Use Black Mode Normal Opacity 100. Do not check Preserve uh, Transparency. And click OK. And you want to double click on that layer that you just made black, and you want to go to Pattern Overlay. And then you want to click on this down arrow, and then you want to click on this right here. It's a, a arrow pointing to the right. And you want to go to Chemical Effects Patterns, and you want to click OK. You want to click on the one up on the bottom right hand corner. It's going to be called Horizontal Scan Lines. So you want to click on that one. In Blend Mode, make sure that's on Overlay. You click OK. Now you're gonna go right here where it says normal make sure that layer is selected the black layer and then you wanna click on it and you wanna click screen and there you go you got your static effect you can add some text or you don't even need to add text you can uh... add 3d text put it behind I think it's gonna give you that effect And just juice it up, create a clippy mess. There you go. That'll go with uh, this image, I guess. Um, but yeah, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And remember, a like is always appreciated. So, yeah. That's all for today, and uh, thanks.